Hello everyone, today we are going to learn how to create a whiteboard animation. First, we need to know what is whiteboard animation. Whiteboard animation is a style of video designed to look like the content is being hand drawn on a white background. Whiteboard animation is a great for explaining difficult concept. It is a particular popular way to communicate complex information because the simple graphics are easy to understand. Example, children's likes animation videos because it is eye catching and easy to understand. So many whiteboard softwares are available on the internet, but I found video sky to be more efficient and easy to use. You can learn video script in a week. Just you need to follow these steps. First, plenty of energy for focus. Second, total 10 hours practice. Third, a pretty good idea of what you want to talk about for your video. And the fourth, a subscription of video scribe software. You can also use 7 days free trial. This is pretty much all you need to succeed. So, what are you waiting for? Alright, first thing first. Let's go get the whiteboard animation softwares. You can google video scripts or go to videoscript.co. So like this you can see this window. First we need to create our account on the site in which you can create your id from your gmail account. Remember you have to set a special character and a numerical word in your password. Next, if your account is created, so we can download the softwares. If you use Windows operating system, you need to download your softwares in .exe format. And if you use Mac, so you have to use .dmg format. If it is downloaded, then you have to install it securely. Remember, you have to not use pirated softwares. If you don't want to pay subscription, you can use 7 days free trial. After 7 days, you can make another trial account. But remember, you need new Gmail ID for every trial account. Okay, so if it is downloaded, you need to sign in with your created email ID and password. After sign in, you will see this type of user interface. This is our home page. In there, you can see some example projects. For creating a new one, you have to click on this button. After that, you can have this type of user interface. You can see I have also created 7 days free trial account. Now you can see there are lots of icon. Like on right hand side there are 3 icon. From first icon you can add new images. After clicking it you will get so many images in its inbuilt library. Personally I like this building images. From them I can represent many locations. Like this, I can get a chance to establish a story or a scene. From this search option, I can directly search any image. And from image option, I can upload image from my computer also. Remember, the inbuilt library image and the my computer image, both images draw in a different manner. And with the help of URL option, I can upload drive images also and second there is a text option from which you can upload any text you want in the project if you wish you can change font textile and color you can also have set proper alignment okay let's see how does it look As you can see, the angles differ from image to image. But if I want, my all images play with a fixed camera angle. So I have to set camera position. And for that, I have to right click the image. Here you can see many options. Important ones are properties. By this, you can change projection time, graphics, filter and drawing hand option. Second important is set camera. By this, I can fix camera and projection angle. 
So let us fix the all images camera. Ok, let's see again. How does it look? From this one, you can set drawing hand. If you want, you can change or delete hand option. And lots of different options are available. If you want, you can use your real own hand. Just click or create a new hand. From this button, you can change your background color or shade. Ok, let's see again. How does it look? You can also change frame or video of giving effect like horror and other. From this button you can add voiceover. You can also upload any other mp3 sound file with the help of this button. If you have a file in PC click on this button. You can also import any mp3 file from URL. Then here is in build music library. You can use this music in your project. This is save as a button and this is save button. If you want to cut or copy any image you can use this button. So this is all about video scribe. If you have any doubt or query please mention in the chat box. So I will see you in the next class. Thanks for watching.